Hey, you guys. I hope everyone is doing well and is feeling blessed. Um, I just wanted to come and kind of share some things that um, has been helping me. And it's been on my heart to like share with like as many people as I can just because right now life is stressful for everyone and I know that and um sometimes we forget that God has us and um don't really focus on the good because we're so overwhelmed and so entangled in the bad that's going on and so <clears throat> i was literally having a hard time um with all this uh that you know the pandemic and then you know work life and home life and managing you know everything and so i started just i had started becoming really really down and so um i don't know how i think i saw an ad for this abide um like sleep meditation on i can't even remember where i really want to try and like put down in the in the comments where i first saw it because i you know i don't want to take credit for anything that i'm about to go over with you guys um that some and it's just some things that has helped me deal with all the stress of life um uh, i know a lot of times when i'm you know trying to wind down like i not so long ago got home from work and i was like i want to really i have been saying i want to do this video i want to do this video and then it's just I don't, I, I haven't done it. And, but God has been putting it on my heart for some reason to just share it. And so I really want to, I was like, okay, whatever. I'm going to do it tonight it, real quick and just give it to, you know, and hopefully it helps and bless someone. And, you know, cause I think that's what, you know, or that's my purpose anyway, for, to bring somebody closer to God, even in their hard times, I guess. So one of the things or one of the most important things that I've been doing is getting into the word um, a lot more. And so I got the Bible study book. I posted um, a picture, I think, on my Instagram or maybe my Facebook. But anyway, this is the uh, my my um, Old Testament. It's an Old Testament and a, a New Testament. So the Old Testament is in this color right here. And it says the same thing right here. But then... Um, then the New Testament is the black book, right? And it comes, um, two books in the thing, in the, um, in the set. I can't remember how much I pay for it, but I'll post that down in, down below too as well. And I have really, I've been a person that's in church my whole life and, you know, and some of the things that I found, um, you know, dig, digging deeper into the word through this Bible study has just really blessed me and has really made things a lot clearer that wasn't very clear to me as a child or even as in, the, in my adult life. Um, so that's one of the things that I've been doing. And then um, another thing has been, because I've been so stressed, it's been hard for me to fall asleep and I would be taking like Benadryl and trying to go to, you know, medication try and go sleep because i'm on medication that may have me up a lot you know so it's just like i haven't been getting, i hadn't been getting enough sleep and you know having to get up and go to work and function and all that and so i was like well i need something that's going you know i need to sleep i need rest and so i got this i found this abide app or abide i i, I think there is an app but i don't i just go on um youtube and key and abide and then it comes up with sleep meditation um the one that i'm on right now is um it's called a uh, it's called i am affirmations and it's um just affirmation of god like scriptures that give you affirmation on you know who you are in god and um and it is in a is in such a like lullaby type of voice that it just calms you and just within minutes or like 
at least like within 10, 20 minutes, I'm asleep. Um, and it's really been helping me. And it and also puts the word of your, of, of the word, the you know, Bible scriptures in your heart, in your sub subconscious, because, you know, it's, it's, con it's in your ear. I have these, um, I don't know what you call them. Um, let me see. They're like the sleep pads, the sleep iPads or the sleep mask. I guess that's what they're called. Um, and I got them off of Amazon. Um, I'm going to pull it up and see if I could. Um, I'm, a, I'm just going to look it up. But it's sleep. It's a sleep mask. I have. It's a Bluetooth sleep mask. Um, and Bluetooth um sleep yeah sleep mask bluetooth sleep mask and um it's it has like speakers in it and i'm gonna link the the i'm gonna put the link in the bot in the bottom i'm not sure if this the same one that i got but it's it's basically the same exact thing it's a sleep um sleep um mask that has a, a bluetooth in it and i connect it to my ipad or my phone or whatever and put on the abide sleep meditation and i go to sleep to that and so it's putting the word in my spirit while i'm asleep and then it just it the soothing sound just puts me to sleep within minutes so that's been helping me get sleep without taking medications to go to sleep and then i'm jog you know groggy throughout the day and i'm on medicines for you know already so the least that i can take is the is better for me so that has really been helping and then i got this little idea from uh tiktok and i don't know please forgive me because i don't know who is who's the 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 creator of it but it's called a good jar a good things jar and so i ended up getting a glass jar and just putting um good things on it and what this is is every month um so it starts out empty and throughout the month i just put like i i jot down good things that has happened to me or good things that is going on in here right i and i i jot it down put it on a piece of paper and put it in here and then by the end of the month you want it overflowing so that it conscious it makes you forces you to constantly think about the good rather the bad you know so that you're not so much focused on the bad all the time because you can think of a thousand things that's going on wrong. And, and I know for me, I could think of everything that's going on wrong, but it's hard for me to really focus on the good. And there is good, no matter what it, what it seems like there is good. And so this makes me think about it throughout the day. Cause I want to be like, I want to put something in my jar. So it makes me think of good things to, to do, to put, to write down, to put in here. And once that month, so once February, it's only been seven days in February. So this is much, this is as far as I've gotten so far. But um, there's days that I put more in than other days or, you know, it just depends. But once February ends, I empty this out, get rid of it, and I start all over again. And so that um, has been helping me to focus on the good and not so much on the bad. And so um, with the conjunction of the Bible study, my um, sleep meditation, and my good things jar, I've been like able to really like be at peace with a lot of things that um, that's happening in my life and just letting God work it out because a lot of times we ask God to work it out. And I know I'm going to speak for myself. I ask God to fix it. I ask God to give me peace and understanding. And then I'm putting it in your hands, Lord. And then next thing I know, I'm picking it. I'm trying to pick it back up and fix it myself because I guess I think God just can't do it, but, or I don't know, but in my, I know that he, if he does it, it's going to be done correct it's going to be done right and um so i just have to you know force myself to think about um 
good things and know that God has me no matter what it seemed like, no matter what the devil, because the adversary will come to you and make you feel like everything in your life is horrible and going wrong. And, you know, you just, just make you feel like just worthless, you know, but that's when you really need to start leaning towards God more or leaning towards, you know, getting in the word and making sure the word is in you so that when those thoughts come, you can, you can counteract it with what God says about you or what God says about the situation. And so those things have been helping me. And I just thought I would share because it had been on my heart to share this a long time ago. And I don't know, tonight when I can't, I was driving home from work. I'm like, Oh, I don't feel like doing this, but I'm because I'm tired and I got to get up and go to work in the morning. But I was like, but it kept, you know, being on my heart to, to, to share this with, um, with people. And, um, so I thought I would share it and I hope it helps someone. I hope someone try it. And if you do try it, comment down below on this video and let me know how, how it worked for you. How was it, you know, helping you, um, and so that I can, I mean, at least know that it did help someone um, because right now with everyone, I mean, uh, people are just going through and it's so hard because you have limited access to people, physical, you know, access to people. And with social media, a lot of times we just kind of vent or, or, talk through that and not really pick up the phone anymore and call people or, you know, or we push our, push people away or e e whatever it is that may be happening. And then you become, you, you in this circle and the, the devil start playing with your mind. Like, don't nobody care about you. You, you don't know, you know what I mean? And so God has just really started showing me a lot of things in scripture, like with things that I'm going through. I'm only in Genesis in this, in this Bible study. Like I should probably already be, oh, I know I should be already in Exodus, but it's been so like hard for me to move on. It just makes me want to dig and find more about why this happened and what, you know, search more into the word and stuff. And so that has just really been helping me with, with my study of getting the word in me and then being able to fall asleep and then being able to think positive with all three of these in conjunction of, with each other. So I just hope it helps someone because I, it's been, like I said, it's been on my heart to uh, share it. And so let me know if you, sh if you try it um, and how it works. You guys be blessed.